guys, it's Janine here, and in today's video, we are going to be learning how to solve a first order differential equation initial value problem using the method of separation of variables. So the goal of separation of variables is to get all your x variables on one side and all of your y variables on the other side. So let's go ahead and take a look at this example here. So here we have the first derivative of y with respect to x plus 2xy squared is equal to 0, and we are given the initial condition y of 0 is equal to 1. So let's go ahead and start out by subtracting both sides by 2xy squared. So from here, these two terms cancel out and we are left with dy over dx is equal to negative 2xy squared. And as a next step, let's go ahead and multiply our entire equation by dx. So we end up with dy is equal to negative 2xy squared dx. And let's go ahead and get our y's on the other side. So we're going to divide this entire thing by y squared, and we're going to divide this side by y squared as well. And so these two y squareds cancel out, and we are left with dy over y squared is equal to negative 2x dx. And from here, we are going to want to integrate both sides. And let's go ahead and rewrite this integral as y to the negative 2 dy, just to make our lives easier. And let's go ahead and bring out the negative 2 out of the integral. So we end up with negative 2 times the integral of x dx. So integrating the left-hand side, we get negative 1 over y. And integrating the right-hand side, we get negative 2x squared over 2 plus a constant. So let's go ahead and cancel out these two terms. So we end up with negative 1 over y is equal to negative x squared plus c. And so let's go ahead and multiply our entire equation by negative 1. And so from here, let's go ahead and take the reciprocal of both sides so we can solve for y. Okay. So now we have our general solution and we want to plug in our initial condition here into our equation so we can solve for our constant. So let's go ahead and do that. And just a note, here x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 1. So plugging in our values, we have 1 for y and we have 1 over and we have x is equal to 0. So we have 0 squared plus c1. And then this is just zero, so we are left with one equals one over c1. And let's go ahead and multiply both sides by c1, and we get that c1 is equal to one. And so let's go ahead and plug in our constant term into our general solution to get our particular solution. So we get y is equal to one over x squared plus one. And that is our final answer. And so that is how you solve a first order differential equations initial value problem using the separation of variables. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments down below. And I'll see you guys next time. Happy studying. Bye.